Hello everyone, I am Sikandar Aburaki from Tute Plus 24. Uh, today I am going to explain uh, how we can send a variable from uh, one component to another and get the value from another component and show it into the template. And uh, we'll also see how we can use input and output uh, command in uh, angular 2 so uh, in our last uh, video we have done this thing so uh, i'm going to create a component from command line Uh, ng generate component about false uh, and inline style. Well. Uh, this is our component and uh, well uh, i have refreshed something here so this is our component uh, about and uh, here we can uh, write something like uh, hr and f component html you can write that means we're going to show our about component just uh, below here uh, i can write app about let me see the uh let me see app about so i can write About and let us see the effect. And this is the separate line and about works. This is our uh, root component, and that means app component, and this is our about component. So, what we are going to do uh, from the app component, we are wanting to say send some uh, value. Uh, do this about uh, component and want to display here so into our app component uh, let us first create a variable like um, uh, show name and We can write Alex here yeah. show name variable and here app about tag here we can write like we'll have to bind it here. Uh, show name and here we have to give some name that means show me now I will have to go to 
is component and here we'll have to include one thing it is input and here at input parenthesis and show me so uh, this variable I want to display here uh, h1 interpolation show me Oh, I did not save it. Okay, you see uh, the name Alex has come from the uh, from the about component. Now, uh, we want to do we want to set some button here and say send some value uh, back to the app component through some event binding so yeah, i'm writing some code input uh, and uh, button okay click and here I have to write some event click and uh, click me dollar event and here uh, one thing I want to show if I if I write this thing here we can display uh, this value into text box also okay and even uh, we can pick this uh, text box value and we can show here also by doing Uh, if I write here like model dot name Uh, we'll have to write a click event here so on click event we can write here and within this event we can send I'm initializing it with some name this dot show name is equal to uh, if I name here Alex 
and initially it is showing Alex and if I uh, click so it is showing second that that means uh, that means it is uh, in, in getting initialized by this value that's why this show name is showing uh, at the first time but when we click uh, this event and then uh, this variable is getting the value from the uh, text input and it is showing that value okay now uh, what uh, i was uh, uh, telling about uh, here Mm. Here uh, I am uh, going to uh, create something like ng model and Uh, model dot name and name okay and click me I will have to create this event click me and here I have to write output and event emitter and here write output Uh, click me so say hello uh, is equal to new event em event emitter Okay, now let's click me and uh, this dot say hello dot emit uh, now. Mm, You'll have to bind this method with here. Uh, for example, my click here. event uh, now we have to go to app.component and create this event and listen from here that event so I can console log and let us see what happens okay uh app.component yes 
it is not getting name because uh, here we used model here we use model but we did not define it here so model will be some object to object and yeah you can see uh, if I write come on Okay, let's see what happens. Uh -huh. We'll have to make some changes. Yeah, send the model and yeah, it is okay. <coughs> now here it is okay and here name okay now if I click from the app dot component this uh, text value will be sent to the about component here and displayed here and if i write here and if from this component by event handler if i click this value and it is going back to uh, root component through this event and this uh, click event <coughs> is uh, triggered here here click me with the model it is going and here uh, the click me event is here this click me it is here and it is uh, using the emit uh, event uh, method of event emitter uh, and uh, in the HTML app dot component.html file here we are burning the event here in this way and uh, in the app component we are creating the my click method uh, which will be triggered by the uh, say hello event say hello uh, uh, method here yeah. And we are uh, passing the value and we are getting this value and uh, this is a, an object so e dot name will be the properties of that object and that we are uh, displaying into this model dot name as we mentioned that into our app component uh, the input name is uh, here we are using like uh, ng model model dot name that's why we, we can uh, display this value there so this value is coming from the uh, app component so this is very uh, helpful for transferring uh, object uh, values and from one component to another uh, hope uh, this will be uh, helpful for you and if you have any question please uh, leave it uh, on the comments and uh, I think you will practice more and more and if you create uh, the complete application then you will uh, understand you will get the total uh, bar's eye view picture so uh, I will be uh, coming uh, on some next uh, tutorial so until that, take care of yourself. Bye.